Hi, and welcome to the MVT Marketing System tutorial on how do you actually get that code to show an image that will link to where you want somebody to go. I had done a tutorial on Backpage and had to post an ad there, but I wanted to go into a little bit more detail here and also add something that I had forgotten to mention in the previous tutorial. When you have an image, you have to house it someplace, and it has to either live on a website or on Facebook or in some some hosting company but if you don't have your own website or your own domain hosted any place there is a free place called photobucket.com and they will help they'll host your images for you for free so go over to photobucket.com and sign up for a free account right over here well, not that I'm sorry that's not it I'm already in so just go over to photobucket.com and sign up and they'll ask you to read their terms of service and sign up um, once you're there, you can now upload images and you will have homes for your images. And if you see these things spinning around, I wanted to make sure that the animated GIFs work in here and they do, which is kind of cool. Now any links that I talk about or any sites on here, I'll make clickable and I'll put either in the YouTube description box or and also on the MVT Marketing System training site underneath the video I'll make put the links in there with the names and so you can just click and go right to them so you don't have to worry about writing this down and remembering it so anyway um, let's go back over to the text and image HTML link generator because this and this is another link I'll give to you this makes doing this so easy for people like myself that can't remember how to write simple HTML code you have two options when you hear a text link or an image link and they're exactly what they sound like a text link is a word or a phrase or a sentence and it links to someplace on the internet and an image is the same thing only it's a picture so we're going to select image link and if you look down there's very few things that you have to put in here to get exactly what you need you need the link URL and the link URL is where do you want the person to go when they click on your image now you can send them anywhere that you want. You can send them to your video channel, you can send them to your web show, you can send them to a specific video on your web show, you can send them to a video email, or you can send them to a page on your marketing system. So I'm going to choose this one. So come back over here to the text and image HTML editor under link URL. I'm going to paste in the link to this this page right here because that's where I want people to go. Now, the next question is open in the same window or a new window. I always like to select a new window because I think that people should not lose what they were looking at, and that's just personal preference and probably a good idea to do. Now, the next thing is the image URL. That is, where, where, what picture do you want to use and where is it living? So again, if you do not have a place to host your images, such as you know, a, a, a GoDaddy or a HostGator account, make sure that you go to photobucket.com and sign up for the free account and you upload your image right here and then once it's uploaded it's going to appear like these appear here and then I want to show you where you find the link just simply hover over the image and you have an email and IM your direct link HTML code and IMG code what you want is the direct link code so if you just put your mouse here and click it it copies it for you come back to the text and image HTML link generator place that link under the image URL and your alternate text is whatever you want it to be so we're talking about my video talk compensation so I'm going to put that then in here and now this is the little magic button you click and lo and behold there is your image there's your code when you click on this image it's going to take you to the page that you told it to take you to which is this one so now you want to come in here and you want to copy this because this is now the code that you're going to put into back page. I'm going to select Charleston. Where you put it is the description. That's it. Now we need a title. Let's just call it that right now. Right now, there is no text in here. You can add text, but I just want to show you how to get this code in here and then to look at it and check it out. So just scroll all the way to the bottom, continue, and scroll down because that's where you, you, you don't need to put the caption in. We're just testing this for now. When you want to place your ad, you're going to need to put that in. So if you come down here, there it is. You used this code 
that you got very easily. Put it in Backpage.com. Let's check it out. Let's click on it. Yep, that's the page I want them to go to. How easy was that? Now, obviously, if you want to say something, you could say something. Generally, I, when I do this, I usually say click on image because people might not necessarily know to do that. It's not intuitive. But that's how easy it is using this text and image HTML editor. And also, if you don't have a place to put your images online, then definitely go and get yourself a photobucket.com account. And you're all set. So I wish you luck and stay tuned for the next video tutorial.